race isn't just between the US and China anymore. China is competing with itself, while the US is pouring in billions into staying ahead. Alibaba just dropped Quen 2.5 Max, claiming it beats OpenAI's GPT-40 and DeepSeek's V3 and even Meta's latest Llama model. Meanwhile, ByteDance and DeepSeek are making big moves, forcing OpenAI, Perplexity and Anthropic to fight back with massive funding. And now SoftBank is in talks to invest $25 billion in OpenAI, a deal that would make it OpenAI's biggest backer ever. So who's actually leading the AI revolution? Let's break it down. Alibaba just launched Quen 2.5 Max and the message is clear. DeepSeek's dominance won't go unchallenged. The Lunar New Year surprise launch shows Alibaba is feeling the heat. The company says Quen 2.5 Max outperforms OpenAI's GPT-40 and even DeepSeek's V3, a bold claim in an AI race that's moving at a lighting speed. But Alibaba isn't the only one reacting. Just two days after DeepSeek released its R1 model, ByteDance upgraded its AI, claiming it beats OpenAI's O1 in key performance benchmarks. This means China is now home to three top AI contenders. DeepSeek, the breakout startup shaping up global AI. Alibaba's Quen, the big tech answer to the AI disruption. ByteDance, leveraging TikTok data to train next-gen AI model. Now, let's break down the three-way battle between DeepSeek, OpenAI and Alibaba's Quen. DeepSeek, with 93% success rate, it's focused on accuracy, efficiency and task completion, excelling in reasoning, coding and structured queries with minimal retries. Its cost-effective model challenges the need for a billion-dollar AI spending. The OG, ChatGPT, is best for brainstorming and creativity, excelling in open-ended discussions, idea generation, dynamic conversation and has been ideal for writers, strategists and businesses exploring multiple solutions. But the latest entrant, Alibaba Squen, that one targets enterprise users, optimizing long-form conversations and business applications while competing with both DeepSeek and OpenAI. But the key difference here is that DeepSeek is all about precision and cost efficiency, while OpenAI leads in creative exploration and Quen aims for business scalability. But DeepSeek's biggest advantage is its affordability. It's proving that cutting-edge AI doesn't have to come with a billion-dollar price tag. OpenAI, in contrast, relies on expensive NVIDIA chips and massive compute power, making it a costly option for businesses. Whereas Alibaba's Quen models are also price competitive, pushing AI costs down even further. The takeaway? DeepSeek's efficiency is forcing price wars, pushing Alibaba and others to cut costs. If OpenAI doesn't find a way to become more efficient, it risks losing ground in the long run. But while China's AI industry is scaling up, US tech giants aren't standing still. Just as China's AI firms go head-to-head, -head, OpenAI is looking to secure its dominance with the $25 billion deal with SoftBank. If finalized, this would make SoftBank OpenAI's biggest backer, even surpassing Microsoft. The deal is a part of Stargate, a joint venture between OpenAI, SoftBank and Oracle, unveiled by President Donald Trump to boost US AI infrastructure. OpenAI is moving towards a for-profit structure, giving it flexibility to raise unlimited capital in its quest to dominate Gen AI. But here's the problem. Investors are getting skeptical. DeepSeek built R1 with just $5.6 million, while OpenAI burns billions each year. Now, Alibaba and ByteDance are proving that China's AI firms don't need massive funding to compete. They just need to be smart and cost-efficient. And it's not just OpenAI. Other US AI companies are scrambling to secure funding too. Anthropic, backed by Amazon and Google, recently raised a $7.6 billion for its Claude models. Perplexity, an AI-first search startup, raised about $73.6 million at a $1 billion valuation, taking on Google in an AI-powered search. But the question remains, is the US overspending on AI? China's firms are proving that leaner, cheaper models can be just as powerful. And if that's true, then investors may start questioning whether OpenAI's billion-dollar budget is even sustainable. China's AI race is now an internal battle as well, pushing innovation at breakneck speed. The US is throwing money at the problem, but OpenAI and its rivals must prove that they can turn massive investments into long-term dominance. Investors are watching closely. If DeepSeek, Alibaba, and ByteDance continue to scale at low cost, the US may need to rethink its AI strategy. With Quen 2.5 Max now in the mix, China isn't just competing with the US, it's competing with itself. Meanwhile, SoftBank's $25 billion bet on OpenAI shows that Silicon Valley is going all in. But in a race where China is proving AI doesn't need to be expensive, the real question is, who has the smarter strategy? Stay tuned because the battle is just getting started.
you for watching CNBC TV 18 and do follow us on all our social media platforms for news, updates and more.